previously on Escape the Night, Joey and his friends are rescued and discover the real threat against Everlock. I thought I was going to save a town, but now we got to save ourselves. There are eight artifacts that this carnival master draws his power from. So if you don't figure this out before sunrise, we are all going to die. JC and Tila are voted into the final challenge and choose a partner to fight for them. Blood has been spilled, yet there are seven artifacts left to defeat the Carnival Master. Not everyone in town is telling the truth. It's Cindy, seeing if you're still coming. It's, um, almost 10. I didn't want to call your house, so leaving a message at the office. Miss you. Bitch trying to sleep with my heart. Run! Stay away. I can give you anything you want. All you have to do is just take my hand. Going. Yeah, I mean, really? Did she not think you were gonna So we don't have much to go off of besides this. The note I found said that somebody in town is not telling the truth. So who do you guys think is lying? Well, we only know two people. That's Calliope and Mortimer, so... I am so thankful that Mortimer and Calliope are targets towards someone's lying. How do we know we can all be trusted? Maybe it's one of us. I'm really keeping my eye on Joey right now. I feel like he's hiding something from us. Tila, how are you feeling coming back from that challenge? I agree with Colleen. We obviously can't trust everybody. Somebody voted me in. But do you think that it was rightfully so? Calliope pulls the map down from the wall. We can see that there are new things on there. Fat Man Slims is new on the map. So I guess every time that we cleanse a new artifact, there's going to be more stuff on the map. Be where the snakes, the serpent's eyes lie in wait. There's this message that says there's gonna be snakes. First we have to deal with clowns, and now we have to deal with snakes. So all of a sudden we see this woman peeping Tom at our meeting. What, what? the? What? Get what? Quick, get oh, her! What? Oh, bitch, you ain't going nowhere, mama. You need hey, to get your ass. She takes off, and I'm like, oh no, bitch! Grab her, grab her. That was the first time I've ever captured and tackled a spy. It felt like a boss. Tie her up. She cannot be trusted. Quick. Wait, tie her? Seriously? Of course we're going to chase her entire up. That's what any normal person would have done. Hey, Listen, worry. honey, what were you doing? I'm looking for the same thing you're looking for. What is that? And what's that? The serpent's eyes. She was bit. The that? snake woman bit me. She stole my husband. She's a man stealer, too? You don't want to cross a woman who's pissed off and is a snake. Do you know anything about an artifact? I don't know. Look for suits in the lounge. That's what suits I heard. In suits the lounge. in the lounge? Yes. What does that mean? Are they evil FBI agents? Do I get a new outfit? Why don't you guys go on? I'll stay here and watch her. Stay tied up. We run back into the lounge, trying to see if there's anything that we haven't seen before to help us solve this clue. Oh, I found cards, guys! Guys, I got a bunch of playing cards. Suits must mean the suits in the deck of cards. Hearts, diamonds, spades, clubs. We gotta find them. I got the club. OK, there's more, there's more. I have the club. Is that all we need? No, we need every single suit. I found this. Oh, some of them 
have num have, no, have markings. I think it maybe all combines together. Here, let's put it on the table. Okay. So I flip over the cards and I start to realize that there's lines on parts of the cards. It's almost like a puzzle that I need to connect all the cards in order to create some sort of symbol. It's an eight. eight. Wait, what? Did what did you find? It's on a dice, but it has a club on it. Club? Bring it. What has to do with dice? A spade, maybe. Or maybe you could. I don't know. Hold on to it. <gasps> oh my god! What is that? That was so weird. That was so weird. What happened? It magnetized to it when I put it down. Oh my god, that has to be something. That's a clue. Okay, let's just leave it there. I feel like we're gonna have to do something with that. Hey, what about this perfume? It has a diamond on it. <gasps> oh my god, spray we have to it spray on, spray bitch! It. Spray it. It correlates. Oh, it's happening. That looks like a map. Yeah, it's so a map. It is. Quickly, we realized this is a map of this room, and there's an X, and if there's an X, there's a clue. Oh, it is this room. Isn't it right here? Okay, the couch is that rectangle in the middle. What else do we have? What other? Wait, you oh, guys there it is! <gasps> Secret door. So inside the trap door is a clock, and each of the hands is printed with a suit. I think we have to arrange it in the correct way. The, the eight. eight correlates with that. We flip the cards over, and they're hearts. Eight equals hearts. The magnetized dice. Every time we roll the dice, it ends up snake eyes, or a one and a club. One equals club. We're missing a spade. We're missing, well, it's the diamond, but there's a the diamond on the map. It says 10, it says 10 on it. Ten diamond. Is there anything else hidden? It's in the fire. I'm looking around for any clues that I can possibly find, and I notice there's a Statue of Liberty missing a hand. As I was walking through the back part of the lounge, I saw a green hand with a ring on it. Oh, look, look at this. Yeah. This is Lady look Liberty's it. torch. It has a spade on it. A spade? What if you look through it or yeah. something? Yeah. Look, look through it. Is it pointing at anything? I'm not seeing anything. Does that circle line up with this circle at all. Okay, so I'm looking through the ring on the Statue of Liberty and it connects to another hole. So I'm like, I need to just line my eye up, look through that hole, connect it to that hole, and there it is. Okay, uh, what's on the pack? The blue, the blue line on it. Is there a number on there? Five. Okay, and five. five. Oh, five. I am just blessed with 2020 vision, so it was the perfect challenge for me. All right. Okay. Oh, oh, what? Oh my god, there's oh my god. stones in here. Inside are the serpent's eyes and a note. This okay. is the second of the wicked artifacts. No. To cleanse the Leave serpent's it. eyes, you must find the head of a great snake, place the eye inside, and bathe it in the blood of a serpent's heart. Success, we have the eyes. But we still have to cleanse the artifact. So what we have to do is find them. this snake, place these inside his head, and bathe it in the blood of the serpent's heart. Now that we have our second artifact, I'm just waiting for that creature to appear. What is going on? What is we hear screams coming from the arcade. Good God, who is dying now? <laughs> oh my God! Oh my God! Oh my God! Oh my God! The woman that we've captured is dead. She just comes back and finishes the job. There goes our one person who could have been helped to us. Might as well check the body. She might have clues as to where we could find more information about this serpent woman. I always seen this in movies. They take off the shoes. Is yes. this wrong? Wait, you guys, you guys, I found it, I found it. Matches, matches, matches. It says, meet me at 7.30, Cindy. Okay. That was the friend she was going Fat to Fat Man meet. Slims. We're about to find out what's at Fat Man Slims. Oh, Fat Man Slims, guys. Snake woman appears out of nowhere and just snatches Roy like a wig off a drag queen. And I was like, <gasps> oh my God, thank God it wasn't me. What happened? You've been poisoned and in 20 minutes, it's gonna eat through your organs yeah. to create an antidote to save him. I know there's a drugstore over there, right? Yeah. yeah. Yes. Maybe we should split up? Okay. Yeah. Okay. I volunteer to go to the drugstore and try to concoct an anti-venom as well as Colleen and Rosanna. The other group, meanwhile, made their way to Fat Man Slims to try and see if perhaps there will be a clue. We gotta be quick. Clean on the couch over there. Calliope says I only have 20 minutes to live and <laughs> I feel hopeless at this point. Okay, 
Okay, there's no one in here, so we need to figure this out on our own. So I walk in this drugstore, and there are potions everywhere, jars full of pills. Here, apothecary field guide. Okay. Anti-venom oh. recipe. We got that was easy. This is okay. an old recipe for anti-venom that will stop even a cobra's bite. We see a bunch of pamphlets on the tables, one of which tells us the exact steps to create an anti-venom. After the ingredients are gathered, they have to be combined in a centrifuge. If done correctly, the liquid will be yellow. So we walk into Fat Man Slams, and I'm automatically thinking, let's grab a drink. Oh, wait, it's almost 7.30. So we start looking around the room to see if there's anything interesting or suspicious. Meet Cindy at 7.30 at Fat Man Slims. Manny, go check upstairs. Oh, my God! What? What? I see someone's eyes looking at me. Stop! I swear to God. You want the package? Well, then you go and give me the password. Cool, so we need to figure out a password to get into the situation. I found a gold box. I bet inside the box is going to be the password. There's a lock box and it has three numbers. We're supposed to meet Cindy here at 7.30. Should we try 730? 730. 730. Oh my god, yes. Yes. Oh my god, yes. Boom, unlocked. Oh my god, Money. Use the photo to get the, the, photo to get the password. Inside are a series of photos that seem to have been taken in different parts of the bar. And it says password phrase. There's five photos. We need five words for this one entire password. Do we need to recreate those moments? I think that we should look in these places. Ingredient one, a pinch of hem. Oh no, there's something. So half, out. so half of it is crossed out. Unfortunately, the recipe was blacked out in certain areas. So while I read out the ingredients, Colleen and Rogue try and locate what specifically we're looking for. I found a hemp of it. There uh, might be more than one. Candy. Hemlock. Hemlock seems you. like a good option. Ingredient two, one drop of snake something. Ingredient three, one drop of something oil. Okay, what are the things again? Because I have snake blood and I have snake venom. I have rose oil and I have tea tree oil. There are actually multiple items that fit each of those criteria. Grab whatever you see. What are the bring other it over, Wait. Bring it over to what this table. Think? Ingredient four, one petal from an evening flower. Five, one pebble that causes water to bubble. Do you wait, bandages? And what is a Henny. petal from an evening Sheen flower? She in here. Oh, what's this? What did you find? I don't know. You can demonstrate hydrophobia is to add calcium carbonate to water. When the calcium carbonate touches water, the resulting process leads to carbon dioxide, which means it's going to bubble. We need calcium carbonate, which is, it's a stomach and acid. Chloride. Know, whatever it is, you guys got to find it. We're working on it, And mix them together, all right? Roy doesn't have time. It just sucks. I can't help him right now, because just being stuck in this couch the whole entire time, I just feel like I'm just not doing anything, not helping the team. Is this poster somewhere? We need to find that poster. Yeah, well. I realize that we must have to look for clues in those parts of the bar that are pictured. What does, what, what does it look like? Is this it? Yep, that's it. It says grass. Are you sure we shouldn't just recreate it? Nikita kind of suggests recreating the photos exactly. Yeah, let's just do it. Let's try yeah, it. Let's try I'll it. be the man with the money. Let's just try and do it as quickly as possible. Please. Yeah, let's do it. I'm like, yes, finally something that I can do and accomplish. This is my moment to shine. That's what I like to see, Nikita. Yes. Yeah. yeah. Oh, oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Tila gets got. You guys, Tila you guys, just got, oh got and Where's taken. Where's Tila? Uh, What's what, 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 what is wrong? What is wrong now? Something is on my back. Uh, on your on your back? What is this? I find a note and an ashtray, and I just all of a sudden I just get this random energy. Like, okay, I can actually help the team now. Come find me. Come find who? Oh my God! Oh my God! Tila. She bit me. She bit me. Tila tells me she's poisoned too. And I told her we could still help the team by solving whatever this puzzle is. Come find me. Should we check the lounge? I'm freaking out. I cannot believe this snake woman just bit me. Anti-venom is developed from the venom of the attacking species. It's important to identify the type of animal that's bitten you. A snake. So we learned that most anti-venoms actually contain venom from the snake that bit you. So that already solved one of our ingredients. I can be helpful that I can find things that are really low to the ground. What about moon lily? That's a night plant. Oh, that's a petal. What? Moon, moon lily at night plant. Moon lily. Moon lily, that's Great. it. That's moon it. Lily? An evening petal. Yes, absolutely. Evening petal. Yes. Everyone is helping, and that's something that I really love about this group. So now okay. we just need calcium carbonate. Okay, I found it, I found it. Calcium yes, carbonate. Yes, 
Yeah, yes. great, there it is. Let's just double check and make okay. sure that calcium carbonate makes the water bubble. Bill Nye, the science guy, eat your heart out. So we start trying to figure out one at a time which ingredients are gonna make the right anti-venom. So here's yes. our calcium carbonate. Here's our lily. Great. Snake venom. So we knew about three of the ingredients for sure. The other two we had multiple options for. Blank oil, it seems like it's only one word, so let's do rose oil. Yes. And then finally hemp something. So we have hemp root and hemlock, so we can try both. Okay. okay. Well this one's this says hemlock in here. Hemlock is so poisonous it can cause death. Well then, that seems like that would probably not be the way to go. So let's start with hemp root. Let's put a little bit of this guy in here. Let's put a little bit of this guy in here. Everything is in. Okay. Yeah. So let's add a little bit of water. Okay. Put that in the centrifuge. We have to keep it Put balanced. Shake it up. Put on. Okay. Okay, you ready? <gasps> yes. We know that if we get it right, it'll be yellow. So that's what we're looking for. Yellow, what? yellow, yellow, yellow. Mm -hmm. Oh, I hear it. Mm -hmm. It's green. It's green. Okay, so that we did it wrong. I'm so shook from that freaking snake Me too, honestly, I'm shook. All right, well, I'm... we have to work as fast as possible because There's Tila is, like, literally dying. Mm, which might not be such a bad thing, you guys. Just saying. Sorry, I'm looking, I'm looking, I'm looking. We have to focus on figuring out this password before the snake woman comes back again. Cold. I have something that says cold. There's this cigarette pack that says green. So green. Wait, you guys, it says under here, it says snakes. You're snakes. kidding. It says snakes right here. So we've got all these words, but we're not sure the order that it's supposed to go in. Wait, wait, wait. You guys, there's a five under the sign. Oh my yes. gosh. How five? did we not notice that? And there's a two on this one. Right. Okay, so let's put it in order. It's on each of the photos is some type of number. Do one, two, maybe they all combine together or something. There's right? three, four, five. What about these clues that were found at these places? Could they be in the order that these are laid out in? So the cigarettes could be green. Cold is this one. So we put these photos in order from one to five and then put their corresponding clues on top of each photo. Green snakes. snakes. Blank, cold, cold grass. grass. What did we do wrong? So we definitely know cal calcium carbonate is right. Okay. We definitely know that the moon lily is right. One drop of blank oil. Let's continue with the rose oil. Okay. Sure about that? It's not long enough to, to fill tr tea tree. Okay. So I would say that rose oil feels accurate. Are we sure that these were all the oils over here? Are we missing an oil? I mean, you said it wasn't big enough to be tea tree, right? Castor oil? It could be castor oil. I don't know. I think it's worth a shot. Roy's running out of time. It's child safe to push it down. Oh. And then pull. Uh. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> Keeps me out. Okay. Okay. Hemp root. Boom. Okay, okay, let's try it. I think this Here's is it. Lid. Here we go. Uh, this has to be it. There we yep, go. Yep, sorry. Okay. Oh, oh there it is. Okay. It's perfect. Yes. Oh. Yes. We see that potion turn yellow and we're like, yes, thank you, man. We gotta get back to Roy. Yeah. Come on. Let's go, let's go. Okay. Watch watch out for the snake woman. So we're just looking for any kind of shape that resembles whatever that image is. We see the image on the wall. Tila, right here. This is strange. What is that? Oh! Oh! Bam, this door opens. What is it? Place me on, on the, the horizon. horizon. Roy! Guys! Guys, Roy, guys, guys! Roy. Oh shit, well we, we got the got bit. Clue. We both got bit. We both okay. got bit. Okay, there's also Tila there? This bitch got bit too. Here, Here we this, have the potion to the drink antidote. it. As soon as I see Matt holding that antidote, I have never felt happier in my life. Not really sure if it's gonna work. Also not sure how it tastes. <laughs> <laughs> Looks kind of like a cross between Capri Sun and urine. It's over there, you guys. It has it's gotta to be. Here. I just, I keep going over there and I can't find anything. I can't either, it's so weird. Uh, okay. Should we just lift up the cushions? Oh, in! We finally solved the riddle. It's green. Green? Snakes in, in cold, cold grass. Cold grass. Like a snake. Oh my God, they're coming. Is that Tila? Come in, come in, come in. Oh my God, you're back. They got the antidote. So with everyone inside, I head up the stairs to give the password to the guy behind the door. Green snakes in cold grass. Oh, I head downstairs. I'll meet you shortly. Well, well, look at this lot. Oh, hey. Each of you, take a car. Why did that back door just open? That's Rodrigo and his friend. Hey, cutie. He's my man servant. Do I have some kind of dating app on or something? Where are all these hunky men coming out of? Uh-oh. I have no idea what could be under that blanket, but whatever it is, it's not going to be good. Oh, my God, oh, my God. That's taller oh, than God. me. That's oh, good. Okay. The cover comes off, and it is a snake tabletop game. It's time to play the serpent's game, okay. where the ante is your life. Inside this tower, there's a golden brick, and it's up to you to find it. And place on the pedestal right there. You topple over the tower, 
you go on to the final death challenge. No vote. Flip your cards over. Now that's the order that you go in. Basically, the object of the Serpent's game was to find the golden brick that was hidden in this wooden tower. If you knock over this tower, your name goes directly in to the death challenge. No pressure. <gasps> Two. Okay. I have ace. What does that mean? First. You go One. First. One. Game on. Okay. Ooh, ooh. Mm -hmm. Wait, can you guys stand still for a second? Thank you. Okay, cool. Oh, careful. Ooh. Gentle. Who's three? This tower is massive. It's taller than me, so I'm so nervous because I don't know physics. Okay, okay, okay. Just, just wiggle, wiggle. Oh, 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 okay. 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 <sighs> Who's four? Me. I was the quickest, so just wanna. Yes! For the first time in your life, pull out. Oh, thank okay. God. Okay. All right, We're does anyone see any gold? No, darling. We have to find the gold. I think it's a dot, because I see all the tops of these, and it's green, green, green. We shouldn't keep pulling pieces that we know that aren't gold. It's a waste of time. Oh, hey. Oh, wow. OK. Oh, my god. Uh, just take one out, Annie. Tila, for the team, I think it's best that you choose one right now, because we are literally running out of time, and we're all about to die. Tila, pick the damn tile. Here's the thing. One of these that actually provides structural integrity could be the one with the gold. Right. Right. So it could be a suicide mission. So it could be a suicide mission. You saved my life, though. You saved my life, Matt. I'll, I, I can do this for you. You are a daredevil. You could jump across this table and stop me as I do this. How are you literally the daredevil, and you're not going to take a chance for all of us? Oh, my God. Calling him out. Ooh, calling I'm just out. saying that he literally saved your life. Why don't you step up, sir? You want I want you to do it. If you are the daredevil of this group, then prove it. All right, you check this well, out hey. then. Roy! It collapses. He's being sent into the final challenge. You happy? This is for you. That's for you. You see, I'm the daredevil, so I think I proved that tonight. Look for the gold. Where's the gold piece? Oh, I have it. Oh my gosh! What? She found the gold! So I grab the golden brick and place it on the pedestal next to the chest. Oh, my God. God. Inside is the serpent's head and a note. Here are the eyes. To finish cleansing the artifact, two must be selected by vote and search the innards of a serpent to claim its heart. We're going to have to vote. So we have to choose another two people to face death. But Roy has already knocked over the tower, so he's automatically in the running. I say we split up again and just discuss among ourselves. Pretty sure we're all thinking the same person. So How quickly guess. into your challenge did she get bad? Very. Very. Really? Yeah. Yes. Okay. How was your guys' dynamics? Everybody felt the same. I felt the same exact way yeah. when Tila got grabbed, mm -hmm. which sucks, but. I'm kind of over this, like, talking in two corners. Can I say something? I really felt as though the Snake Queen herself chose the two weakest. Nikita is really starting to create some divisions in this team. Can we just start voting and let the cards decide? Well, Tila, do you have anything to defend yourself? I didn't really have a chance to discover much, but I think I think I pulled my weight somewhat. She's basically not pleading her case at all. Let's just get this over with. The first person to be into the challenge is the daredevil. Understood. Which leaves only one slot. Mortimer, how do you feel about all this? I mean, the voting stuff's her idea. Calliope, we, we don't have to keep doing this. Must be done. I think I'm going to vote for Tila. We need just the strongest people. She's not contributing enough here, so she's got to go. Guys, there's only a certain amount of cards per person. So we might not get to vote for our first choice, is what exactly. you're saying to me? Are you kidding me? Oh. Tila's cards were gone. Who can I logically vote in to battle Roy? Even though Rosanna is, like, yay tall, she's one tough cookie, and don't underestimate her. You know what? I'm just gonna have to pick Colleen. Like, we didn't have any interactions in our one-in-one -one setting. I voted for Nikita. We don't want troublemakers in this group. If we're gonna get through this night, we need to do it together. I don't want anything bad to happen to anyone. I just felt like there was no good decision there. I will now shuffle. Oh, my gosh. Are you ready? Yeah. The person going into the challenge with the daredevil is... My heart 
drops. Nikita. The troublemaker. It's clear that by being vocal about my opinion, it's put a target on my back. You called me out, and now you're here with me, girl. Oh! Good luck! Here we are. Put these on. There's one for each of you. Oh, please don't tell any others that I was wearing anything looking like this. If I die, I'm gonna haunt all of you. Here's the rules of the challenge. Search the intestines of the great serpent to find the missing pieces of your mosaic. A completed image is at the end of the snake to guide you. The first to do so will be able to retrieve the heart, and the other will be poisoned by the snake woman. Good luck. I hate snakes. Are you guys ready? Go! Oh my god, this is so gross! Oh my god! There are parts of the bodies I didn't even know existed, squishy things, gooey things. It's really hard because everything feels the same, and it's freezing outside, so my hands are numb. I don't know what it's supposed to look like. There is a map opposite from the mosaic so I can figure out how I'm actually supposed to put it together. Oh, God, yeah, this fine. is so slimy. What kind of substance is this? Holy, fix the wheel. I found this piece. I don't know if that's even the piece. My head is in so many thoughts. Am I going to die? Am I going to find these pieces? What's Nikita doing? <laughs> OK. OK, OK. Nikita, you're the troublemaker. Don't back down. Listen, I hate snakes, but one thing I hate more than snakes is losing. This doesn't make sense at all. What the heck? I swear, oh, what if the heck? I get out of this, I'm going to hurt someone. This is so disgusting. Oh my god. Oh my god, oh my god. two more pieces, but I can't even find it. Right on the bottom, right on the bottom. Right on the bottom. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. I actually did it. I'm coming out as the winner. No! Hey! Oh, two! No! No! Although I feel really bad for Roy, I also know I have to get that damn heart. No! 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 Oh, my God. This is no! Sorry, bye. Love you. <laughs> you did it. Okay. What do I do? What do I do? Squeeze the heart over the head. <laughs> Are you okay? Rose struggling. What's no, wrong? I felt just really guilty. I just picked someone who I hadn't worked the most with. I didn't know what else to do. So Rosanna starts crying, and I start to get the inkling that she's the one that voted for Nikita. And I'm starting to get a little bit pissed. Like, if they didn't come back, if they died, you'd feel like it was your fault. If Nikita comes out of this alive, Ro is in some serious trouble with Nikita. Why do you have Nikita's Wait, coat? Wait, what? I see Calliope walk in with Nikita's jacket, and my heart sinks. Nikita! which any of you bitches voted for me. I'm coming for you next. Someone put my name in that box. And for what? Being truthful to the group? I am so relieved, especially because she's a fierce competitor, and I know that she's going to help us get out of here. Of course, that does mean that Roy died. And it's sad because he basically sacrificed himself for us. There's only a few hours, and there's a whole lot of artifacts to find. And if we don't cleanse them all by sunrise, then we're all done for. Guava didn't die in vain. We found this together, and we haven't figured it out yet. It says, place me on the horizon. OK. So we need a horizon. Uh, there's a picture of horizon right over there. Where? Right there. OK. <gasps> oh, oh, my God! What the oh, hell? Oh, my God! Oh, there's a note. my gosh. Inside What's lies the harp of Lazarus. However, the box can only be opened by finding two brass coins that are hidden throughout Everlock and require an additional task to obtain. I have no idea what is in this box, but if it's going to help us, we need to figure out how to open it. At this rate, the guys are dropping like flies. I'm one of the girls. Don't look at me. So you guys see these slots where the coins go? Yeah. Oh. That's the same design that was on Joey's bag at the very beginning. The night is young yet, but anything can happen.